Hello everyone, we're back with another drawing, it's Ice and Soul, and also this is my Halloween art, but I had to post on Monday, because Monday posting schedule, you guys know. Okay, so I started out drawing, I found out that this is a really cute way to make feet, so I eventually ended up just copying it, I ended up like just doing it all like that and stuff. I made Sol's floofy little tail. Sol has a floofy tail. Wait a second, one second. For a second I thought I made something wrong, so I had to check the actual photo that I finished. But I did not, so this is correct. This drawing is good. Oh wait. Nah, I didn't do the little like thing for the for the leg thing, but don't worry about it, it's good, it's good enough. Also, Soul's floofs were quite easy to incorporate, I wanted to add more floofs, but eventually I just decided to do these. God, his eyes looking okay. After multiple tries, like usual. And I uh, kept it going. Also, uh, I'm going to have a poll on Twitter of which thing I should draw next week. I will be including a link. Uh, I mean, no, not a link. My Twitter is in my link tree, which is in my bio thing. My bio thing. Yeah, that's where it is. You guys can get a link to my Twitter and go over there, and I will have a thing of which shall we draw next week. The options will probably be sneaky and aspen and sweaters, because that's something I want to draw soon. Or, um, I don't really know. Let me think. Um, okay, better than that, can I draw? Oh, yeah. Other like, fox gods that I've created in my mind. I, and the options of those fox gods are, the, like, fortune and, uh, what was her other kind? The fortune and, uh, like, um, time god, which can tell your fortune, and it is really good time aka i get to do a really cool design of like um stuff that is associated with fortune tellers and then also add some cool like money things because it's the fortune god it can tell your fortune it also has money So pretty much Soul's almost done in this. Oh, also he's in a different form than usual. That's why he looks different. I forgot to describe that. That is just what happens. Soul can take two. Uh, has two different, uh, three different forms. One's a human form. One's this form, and one's just Soul. He has three forms, and it's cool. At one point I wanted to do this, but then eventually I decided against it. I was like, no, I'm just gonna do white pupils, because that's just what Soul gets. Soul just has white pupils at this point. I don't even think he has black pupils anymore. I'm like, he's moved on from that, mostly because of his dark color for eyes. Oh, also at one point, I did change the eye color to match, like... The yellow, I, or the pink, I don't know. Yeah, I think it was to match the pink, or, oh, I think it was to match the orange. Yeah, I changed it to the exact one that matches his orange. To make it look cooler. And, oh, and the other god that I could be drawing is the god of the underworld. Or also I could just draw, I mean, the goddess, because that's a goddess. 
and then uh, there's a lot of goddesses I just gotta tell you guys for some reason I just decided a lot of goddesses and not many gods mostly because then it makes Sol feel more special that he is a sun god not a goddess so it made him feel more special if I introduce you these guys too. Also, uh, we could be drawing the goddess of the moon, which I have a very fun idea to do. It involves soul because they're, uh, because this is his sibling. The goddess of the moon is his sibling. Is his sister. The goddess of the moon is his sister, so there's a fun idea I've come up with actually technically twin but not identical twins she's also the goddess of music so soul does like nothing yet everyone else has like multiple jobs Arden the goddess of the underworld who has like no other jobs Ooh, look, I actually got horns to look different than before. I actually made them look cool. Tail. Tail stuff. Oh, also something else I could talk about in this time is that I will be doing, uh, making this really cool essay that I will be publishing, like, I don't know if it'll be on Wattpad or Amino or Tumblr, maybe all, but, like, it's going to be a DuckTales one about how the characters changed throughout, like, the time they've been from the old show to the new one. I might even look at the comics a little to get even more info, because there's a lot of changes, and it's really interesting. Uh, so I can write about it. Also, it seems fun to write about. <laughs> also, I like how this drawing, it's like hardly anything is happening in it. Like, I drew ice entirely and then just threw a blanket over him. I'm like, aha. I have captured it. Ooh, also I had to talk about how much candy I got. I got like entire pillowcase worth of candy when it was trick-or-treating time it was so much fun I trick-or-treated on my own for the first time no I am not a child like a 10 year old trick-or-treating on their own for the first time or a nine year old I'm a 14 year old almost 15 like I'll be 15 in March which is quite soon and my mom is just paranoid and just never let me trick or treat on my own. So, that's really what's working. I also felt like how I colored Ice's muzzle just to notice that it didn't need coloring. And that color it needed to be blue. Okay, so poll will be out on Twitter soon, and... Oh, also, I did a little shading on this. Oh, also, another thing is that I do have a redraw. I have put it out on... And amino so far, like, on, actually not my own Amino, instead of the Fox's Amino. But I will be putting it out on Instagram later today, probably. So, you better, guys, you guys better check that out. Maybe also Twitter, because Twitter is fun to put art out on. Also, uh, you guys can be confused on what this darkness is. It is shading. I am having to go over everything to show.
shade it down. But then with soul, I figured it out better, and I just knew how to do it. Sorry about the silence for a second. I'm just trying to figure out what to say. I guess I should pause it for a second while I think. You know what? I'm just going to talk about Ice and Soul and something that I'm planning. I'm also planning eventually I'm going to redraw the first dart that they were in. Because I think a redraw of that would be absolutely amazing. Because you could just see them like change in it. Ice got proper proportions. Soul <gasps> looks cool. <laughs> Because the first start looked absolutely trash. It was absolutely gross. I was like, what? How are these proportions working? How can Ice stand? His body was, like, so small compared to his head. His head was, like, the size of, like, the world. And then his body was just like an ant. It was not good art. But if I redraw it, I can make him actually have good proportions. Also, somehow his proportions have just become normal, but, like, they have gotten better. Like, look at him now. He's still the same small fox from those proportions, yet he's better now. Ooh, it's time to do the fallback trap stuff. And then I just randomly starred at this time. I used to make, like, really complex stars, but this time I just didn't. Also, I needed to do the ears, because I forgot about those. And then you guys know the drill to make it look real. Then also I did the little shadows. Then I turned the shadows into actual shadows. Ta-da! Ta-da! It's all done. Bye, everyone!